All right, what's up, Hot Squad? And welcome back to my Hot Banger Train Marathon. So it's now finally come down to this. The last Hot Banger reaction of the week. Man, I all doing this in one day, absolutely nuts, man. I've been doing this all freaking day. And yeah, I'm absolutely am loving this, man. So I just want to get this over with. So I don't worry about it next week. I am exhausted as hell. Trust me, I am. But hey, look, I dropped it for y'all because I want to get it over with. You know, I love doing this every single week. So thank y'all so much for joining me today. And of course, if you've seen my other Hot Banger reactions previously. So yes, Hot Squad, we finally made it. The last official Hot Banger reaction. So this is going to be the official gameplay reveal and a showcase of Star Wars Outlaws from Ubisoft. So I actually reacted to the official story trailer of Star Wars Outlaws. I thought it was decent enough, you know. I'm not a big Star Wars fan like that, but I have played Jedi Survivor and Jedi Fallen Order. And watch some of the Star Wars movies. And I know the Acolyte is getting a bunch of hate, guys. I know the Acolyte is getting a, a lot of hate. I mean, whoo wee. But I haven't seen it yet, so who am I to judge? So, Hot Squad, let's get straight into it. We're going to check out the Star Wars Outlaws official gameplay showcase right now for Ubisoft Forward. Let's get straight into it. Hit it, hit it, hit it, hit it, get it, get it, get it, get it. New record. At the top, where it should be. Let's go, Nix. Hello, everyone. I'm Matthias Carlson, game director at Massive Entertainment. Hello, Matthias. Today, we'll show you a different type of adventure. And as we journey across multiple systems, we will come across many opportunities for a scoundrel. In Star Wars Outlaws, one of your motivations for exploration is to find elusive experts scattered across the galaxy. These experts will help Kay pick up new skills to survive in the underworld. Here, we're looking for a gunslinger who can teach us some new tricks. Our intel points to the Mos Eisley Cantina on Tatooine. So let's head back to our ship. We're picking up in Acra Station. A remnant of the Clone Wars, it used to be a refueling station that now acts as a trade hub for illegal contraband. It's a great place to resupply. Merchants are often affiliated with a syndicate and might offer you a special deal if you're in good standing with them. This kind of business attracts all kinds of shipjackers, contract brokers, and corrupt officials. Need your name cleared from the wanted list. Your ship, the Trailblazer, is a refined EML 850, the last of its kind. Mm. On board, you'll find everything you need to finalize your preparations. Hey, Andy. Hi, Katie. Space. Each planet has its own system for you to explore, and many opportunities to make a few credits, which you can choose to engage with or not. I am under attack! My ship will not survive long! This is Kay Bess, on board the Trailblazer. I'm coming to help. Turret activated, Kay. One down. In space, your actions also have consequences and can impact your reputation with syndicates. <coughs> 
This optional dogfight allowed us to improve our reputation with the Pikes while making a few credits. Hmm. Spooling up the hyperdrive. Now let's continue our journey and head to Tatooine. Tatooine Space, Edge of the Galaxy. The tattoo system is in the clutches of the Hot Cartel. Our reputation with them is poor, so we best be on our way. Welcome to legendary Mos Eisley, the infamous hive of scum and villainy. We could head straight to our destination, or explore what the city has to offer. Recreating this iconic city is a dream come true for our team, allowing us to show parts of Mos Eisley you've never seen before. Room for one more? There are many opportunities for a scoundrel, including working your way in with the Hot Cartel. Most of Tatooine's economy is under their control, even though the increased Imperial presence has been hurting their business. But first, we need to pick up the trail of our expert gunslinger. The best place to start is the cantina. By asking around, we learn of a pirate who is deadly with the blaster and who used to work for the Hot Cartel. Our intel leads to one of their storehouses, located in the southern hills. Traveling to your destination can be an adventure in itself. As you move across scorching dunes and dusty valleys, you will quickly realize that this lawless desert planet still holds many mysteries. We've reached our destination. We need to locate our storehouse and find our way into this heavily guarded fortress without triggering the alarm. Busy place. data pad or something that can tell me who that old gunslinger is. Sense anyone close? Sutta. Easy. All right, let's see what we have here. <coughs> Got it. Wait, Quint? That sheriff from Wayfar used to work for the huts? I should talk to her. Oh, come on! <laughs> no. We've been spotted, but we now know where to find our guns. Oh. Let's get out of here quick. We're in trouble, pal!
Interesting. Actually, I'm here for you. I heard you're the best shot on the planet. Oh, and you want to be second best. Now is not a good time. The huts are coming and I need to get ready. Get your blaster out. What we have just shown you is the beginning of one of the many adventures you can go on in Star Wars Outlaws. Mm. Whether you want to learn new blaster skills, upgrade your speeder, Will become an unstoppable thief. Finding an expert is always an adventure in a galaxy full of opportunities. We should keep moving. Okay, well, that's it, okay. I have to admit, this was pretty damn decent. Pretty average at best, I have to admit. This was a pretty average um, showcase at best. I know they didn't want to show it too much, but it was average, you know, pretty decent, you know. August 30th comes out, so this could be hopefully be good, hopefully. <laughs> but yeah, uh, yeah, this is pretty decent, you know. I, I read to the story chat, I thought, like, okay, this could be good, pretty decent, right? So, I mean, it can't be, it can't fail, right? It can't fail, so hopefully, it, you know. Hopefully it's good. It's all I really can say, that's hopefully it's good. I don't want to criticize it or whatnot. But overall, Hot Squad, I actually enjoyed that. I actually thought it was okay. So, like I said, Hot Squad, I finally caught up to my Hot Baker trade reactions from last month I've been trying to get to. Because I had a bunch of homework to get done. My gosh, it has been nuts. And yeah, yes, man, it has been absolutely nuts with this college, college semester, so semester, so try to catch up on much heartbreak reactions because we finally made it to July and I have a lot of heartbreak reactions to get through this week, y'all. So I'm glad I got a chance to do these today because tomorrow, well, not tomorrow, later, hopefully in the weekend, I'll try to do every single one of them, which I have, you know, posted on my schedule. So I can catch up on any every everyone need to miss out on. So yeah, this this was actually a huge blast, huge blast getting through a marathon of hot banger trailers. So hot squad, that's my conclusion of my reaction to the official gameplay showcase of Star Wars Outlaws. So you enjoyed this? Please, please hit the like button. Comment, share your thoughts. Which is favorite Star Wars game? Do you think it's going to be good? Do you think it's going to be average? And who knows? Who knows what Ubisoft and Massive get their up their sleeve, right? So hopefully it's good. You know, hopefully it's good. So Hot Squad, this is your man Taurus Hawk. Sign out for today. I will see y'all later this week with my new clean slate of Hot Baker reactions. So Hot Squad, safe out the sky. Peace out. I'm going to see y'all later this week and have a great day.